From the first Aliyah to the Holy Land in the 18th century, the leader of Chabad Lubavitch, known as the Alter Rebbe, established Kolel Chabad to encourage and support these early pioneers. The Alter Rebbe took personal responsibility for their survival and well-being. Ever since, it's been the responsibility of each Jew to support their brethren in Israel. Indeed, Kolel Chabad is the oldest continually operating Jewish charity in the Holy Land. For over 200 years, each succeeding Rebbe of Chabad Lubavitch has personally headed and has taken personal responsibility for Kolel Chabad. In our times, it's been the Lubavitcher Rebbe, Rabbi Menachem M. Schneerson. Throughout generations of oppression and pogroms, Kolel Chabad has provided moral and material support to beleaguered Jews in Israel and their community institutions. This continues unabated until this very day. Indeed, it has only intensified. Each year, we gather to give honor and thanks to those who make this vital work possible. Let's welcome Rabbi Yechiel Eckstein. Tomer and Jennifer Beton, Roberto Gutman, Yitzhak Tesler, Ohad Fisherman, Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Kolel Chabad International Awards Dinner. Jerusalem as an ancient city, every nook and cranny is layered with thousands of years of Jewish history. Yet this once glorious metropolis, where King David and King Solomon reigned, and the Holy Temple stood in all its glory, is now the scene of much tragedy, as thousands of survivors live on the brink of starvation. Coming to their rescue is Kolel Chabad. Since 1788, this noble organization has prevented starvation in Jerusalem by distributing food to the holy city's poorest. Every day, hundreds of helpless old men and women line up patiently to receive food rations that will enable them to survive for yet another week in their new but ancient homeland. During the winter of 1978, the Rebbe personally summoned a young man and gave him his life mission. To revitalize the oldest Chabad institution, the social welfare arm of Chabad in Israel, and bring it into the 21st century. Under the Rebbe's directive and blessing, <laughs> and with the help of its many partners, Kolel Chabad continues to grow by leaps and bounds, charging forward and becoming a conglomerate of Chesed. Ladies and gentlemen, the highlight of this evening, the annual Shareholders Report. Hanukkah hasn't started yet. However, the menorahs you see on your tables have already given a great deal of light. Because these are no ordinary Hanukkah menorahs. They are the artistic endeavors of some of Israel's most severely challenged men and women, the 40 residents at the Kolel Chabad Grabsky Rehabilitation Center for young victims of multiple sclerosis. The menorah gives warmth, gives strength, gives happiness, and gives purpose. On behalf of the artists who made these menorahs, 
and on behalf of all those that benefit from your abundance of kindness. Thank you for joining us and have a happy Hanukkah.